Apple will purportedly roll out a scaled down Apple Car in 2028. Apple will purportedly roll out a scaled down Apple Car in 2028, according to a Bloomberg article by Mark Gurman. Apple Inc. is reaching a make or break point in its decade old effort to build a car, has pivoted to a less ambitious design with the intent of finally bringing an electric vehicle to market, he writes. After previously envisioning a truly driverless car, the company is now working on an EV with more limited features, according to people with knowledge of the project. Apple had originally hoped to debut a long-in-the-works Apple car in 2026, but plans and personnel on the project have changed multiple times. If the company can't debut an electric vehicle with the feature set it wants, executives may seriously reconsider the project's existence, Gurman writes. The Apple car project, dubbed, at least at one time, Project Titan, has had a tumultuous history. For example, in July 2021 it was announced that Apple Vice President of Technology Kevin Lynch would take a role in leading the development of the Apple car. This happened after Doug Field, who had headed the project, left Apple for Ford. Lynch joined Apple in 2013 after working as the Chief Technology Officer of Adobe Systems. He has been responsible for, among other things, developing the Apple Watch software. In 2016, Apple convinced Bob Mansfield, former senior vice president of technologies, to come out of retirement to run Project Titan. However, he retired again in 2020 with, at that point, John John Andrea, Apple's senior vice president of machine learning and AI strategy, assuming command of Project Titan. About the patent. The patent relates generally to systems that generate warnings, and, more particularly, warnings such as brake light warnings for vehicles. When a driver brakes to slow a vehicle, the brake lights are activated. The brake lights are mounted on the rear of the vehicle, so the driver of following vehicle can be informed about the braking status of the vehicle. Some vehicles have brake lights that flash under hard braking to warn following vehicles. In the patent Apple says that although existing systems for informing following vehicles of braking status can be satisfactory in normal driving conditions, it would be desirable to provide additional brake status information and additional warnings in many situations. The tech giant wants its Apple car to provide improved brake lighting and warning systems. Summary of the patent. Here's Apple's abstract of the patent. A system may have system controls that are used in controlling the system. The system may have sensors that gather information on speed, orientation, and position. The sensors may also gather information on relative speed, information on risks of a collision, and other status information and operating environment information. Control circuitry may use light-based devices to display information on speed, relative speed, status information, custom light information or other user-selected information, or other information on status and the operating environment. When might we see an Apple car? Analyst Ming-Kai Kuo has said that Apple's work on the Apple car has lost all visibility at the current time. He has noted that if Apple does not adopt some kind of acquisition strategy to make inroads in the automotive market, it is unlikely that the Apple CAR will be able to go into mass production within the next few years. On November 18, 2021, Bloomberg reported that Apple was accelerating development on its Apple car. The article said that the electric vehicle will be self-driving and could roll out in 2025. However, this doesn't look like a feasible scenario.